Now, your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News. The number of confirmed cases of the coronavirus here in Michigan, it continues to grow. Now, the quick spread appears to be one of the main reasons Governor Gretchen Whitmer declared a stay at home order, which is now in effect and set to last for the next three weeks. As of this morning, there are more than 1300 confirmed cases here in Michigan. The death toll also rising up to 15 now. That's six more than we reported uh, just yesterday morning. Oakland University is shutting down all campus housing in response to Governor Whitmer's stay at home order. Students have until 5 p.m. tomorrow to get their belongings out of dorms, apartments, and also Greek uh, premises. Exemptions are in place for international and out of state students and other extreme cases, but classes, the, they have already been moved online. All right, mid 30s this morning and uh, after the snow we had yesterday morning, it was a reminder that yeah, it's still March and we get some pretty big temperature swings. Well, today is going to be the coldest day we have in the seven day forecast, which is great news because today it's, it's not like it's going to be that chilly out. It's going to be in the mid to upper 40s this afternoon. Right now it is 36 in Royal Oak. It's 28 degrees in Port Huron, 44 in Port Huron for a high this afternoon and in Ypsilanti today, 42 degrees by noon. Will be cloudy this morning. Some peaks of sunshine possible late in the day today. We'll be in the mid to upper 40s though this afternoon. 58 will be the high temperature tomorrow, by the way. Warmer weather on the way. These have been your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News.